so. What's the verdict? I don't know. <laughs> Ain't good. What's up, guys? Hello. So today, we have something we want to share with you. Yeah. It's the 75th day of 75 hard. It is. What? We're almost done. Yeah, so no pizza yet today, but pizza and beer is on the list tomorrow. For sure. Just um, finishing up some water today and we're good to go. What are we doing today? Today is going to be a magnificent day because we are at the Tiny House Festival in Brighton, Colorado. So we're going to go check out all of these awesome tiny homes, other schoolies and vans and whatever our, else we can find. Our people. Our type of people. So we are pretty stoked. We were a little skeptic because it was really rainy this morning and there's chance of rain all day today and tomorrow. But the sky kind of cleared up and so we're here. We're going to see as much as we can see and we're going to take you along with us. And we're also going to what? find a bunch of people for the road trip squad yeah. and i know that i keep saying something about the road trip squad but that means you got to keep watching because there's some huge things coming for the road trip squad so stay tuned we'll be dropping something soon we're pretty excited about it and you should be too let's go check it out So we were coming up along some different schoolies that are converted and we agreed that we're going to check them out first just because in case it rains but we want to get some ideas for ours and just kind of see how they've done things. This is your guys's. Yeah. This is awesome. Yeah. Do you guys have your bus here? Yeah. We do. Out in the parking lot. Yeah. Not in the Not show. In the show. Yeah. We just started converting ours lot like over the whole winter. Sure. Oh sweet. So it's yeah. not yeah. So we're not completely done, but yeah. that's alright. Yeah. No, this is awesome, guys. Thanks. Yeah, I like it. Well you guys are fellow school people, so we'll look at that. Uh, we have well here. Right now, but Oh, you got some too? Well, we don't no, have we stickers. Have a, we We're working on it. Yeah. So how long you but, guys? How long you guys been doing it? Um. Oh, there's two here. Yeah, that's two fine. Um, that is awesome. How long we've been doing it? Four, we've been on the road full time for like 14 yeah. months. Okay. Um, and gone all across like most of the Western U.S. and parts of Canada. Okay. Um, for the first like eight months when we were traveling, we had like pre-bus life, like friends' weddings and stuff, so we kept going back. Sure. Like, oh yeah, to yeah. Seattle. Oh, you're so from we Seattle. didn't go super far. Okay. Yeah. We just did kind of like mini like two months trips and all the way back. Sure. But like pretty much all the west from like Texas west. Okay. Everywhere. Your guys is? Yes. Nice.
All right, guys, so we obviously came to the tiny house festival and we are festivaled up <laughs> and we have found festivillians <laughs> and, and they are with us and we are we are uh tiny housing busing right now so first of all let's just say who Hello. are you i'm jessica with bus with us my husband's elsewhere and his name is Forrest. Yes. His name is Forrest. We have a Forrest Green bus. That's how you remember us. Sure. Or Forrest Gump. Forrest. Or Forrest Gump. Even yeah. though I've never seen Forrest Gump. Oh, man. <laughs> who's, oh, got no. the, who's got the TV in the tiny house? <laughs> I won't watch it because I love people's Forrest reactions sure. to why. Sure. Um, I got it on disc. Though. And I've heard so many yeah. people quote uh, Forrest Gump to me yeah. that I feel like I've. I I've probably know it. more quotes than you do. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <That's cool. laughs> sure. Next we have. Hi, I'm Aaron. I'm with Stu, the bus who you are currently in. Sure. And that's Kat, and we live in Stu. Stu's actually a rad ass bus. We've been in it, I don't know, like all day. We... At least a good five It was hours. actually, yeah. it was our first stop today. And we stayed for like four hours yeah. in their bus. <laughs> it was awesome. And like so that's why we didn't cookies. catch very much video for you because we got occupied by staying in this bus for four hours. Oh, it's pretty rad. You should check them out. Um, and so we're doing cooking now. Um, Kat's going to do a cooking <laughs> class And for we're going to give you a cooking class. <laughs> a schooly cooking class. What are you class? making? Okay, so we're making up some ramen here. So we got the jet boil going, cooking the ramen. And what are you putting in your ramen? So I'm going to be bougie and put in some spinach, some sriracha, and some avocado. It's going to be dang. <laughs> and, some, and some tequila. Yeah, I mean... That's, that's that's there's what? actually no water in it that is made with tequila. <laughs> sure, <laughs> and this is this is the final what it looks oh, like yeah. and it is delicious it, is it delicious. looks bomb she says it's delicious we trust her um yeah we just wanted to share with you guys yeah so so if you would check them out check out Stu the bus and bus with, with, us. Us, bus with us on instagram youtube um <laughs> check them out follow them they're awesome people and we hope you guys enjoy so I grew up in Florida, and you know, Southern people, uh, Florida's not Southern, by the way, but other Southern people, you gotta worry about running over deers and shit. We had to worry about running over alligators and iguanas. Uh, so growing up in our backyard, we had a, uh, a dock and a boat, and then we lived on an intercoastal, and then we had an avocado tree and a mango tree and iguanas would come and eat the mangoes or avocados that fell from that tree, shit on our dock, <laughs> and then dive into the water. And my mom fucking hated that shit. And she's like, she's like to my dad, she's like, we need to get rid of these fucking avocado trees because I'm sick and tired of these fucking iguanas shitting on my dock. <laughs> All right, guys. So yesterday we left you at the Tiny House Festival which is super awesome. But bad news is we're starting to have some problems with the bus. We really don't know what's going on with it. We don't know if it's the battery, if it's the alternator, the fuel pump, um, but it's been acting really weird. So I don't know if this is the end. I don't know, I don't know what's gonna happen. Um, so we're gonna go take it in, get it checked out, see what's going on. We'll update you with the rest later. So, what's the verdict? I don't know. <laughs> Ain't good. Well, what was it? Well, it wasn't the fuel pump. It wasn't the alternator. It wasn't the battery. It actually needed some extra washer fluid in a passenger side of Alright guys, so all jokes aside, the bus is good. We did get the oil changed the other day and we are ready for some news we want to tell you. So after our time at the Tiny House Festival, um, we had seen a whole lot of different ideas and stuff that people have done. And it's really got us thinking about our bus build that we have and 
what we have going on. And so now, well, you just You just never know with you us. You never know with us. Spread love. Bye, guys.